Hi guys, today I am in my dining room, as you can probably tell. If you missed my last video, I showed decorating this entire tree, so if you guys missed that, I'll have it linked down below, and make sure to check it out because I love the way that tree <laughs> turned out. But today I'm going to be decorating my dining room for Christmas, so I'm going to get it all set up. I've got a bunch of stuff down here on the floor. A lot of the items are from Target mostly, but I'll leave links down below for everything that I've recently picked up. So I kind of have a vision in my head of what I want the dining room to look like. So hopefully everything comes together nicely. Hopefully you guys enjoy and get some inspiration while watching this video for your dining room or whatever. So hope you enjoy, let's get started. So I've already put this tree in the corner over here. I did this a few weeks ago, I think, but this is from Bed Bath & Beyond. I had it in my guest bedroom last year, and this year I just thought it would be cute in here. Got the little tree skirt, the mini one from Target. It matches the one on my large tree. And I just wanted to add a few little ornaments to it. This is a pre-lit tree. I wanna do something kind of just simple in here. And I didn't use any of my silver ornaments this year on my big tree these were all like leftover from decorating my big tree i didn't use any of these ones this year i used them last year so i thought that would look good it'll kind of blend with this tree but not like take away from this tree because it'll still be just like really simple over there Now that I have the bulbs on that little tree over there, the next thing I wanna do is put a little wreath right here in the middle of this, these two windows. I've never done that before, but I just think it would look really nice. So I have this one that I got last year from Bed Bath & Beyond. I just think it's really simple. It kind of complements all of the decor that I'm doing in like this formal living room and this dining room. It's just like simple, but pretty, a little glittery. So I love this, I think it's gorgeous. My other room is definitely like my kitchen and family room is definitely gonna be a little more colorful. If you guys saw my flocked tree, it's like pretty colorful and stuff. But in here, I'm gonna keep everything like really simple and kind of just more plain. <laughs> I'm gonna use a command hook. I have never used a command hook in my life. So hopefully I do this right. I've actually never used one. Do you know how to use one? Yes. Do you really? Yes, all the time in college. I think we've got the command hook situation figured out, but I wanted Joshua to hold the wreath so I could see where I wanted it. I think I want it lower. Like, I think. Maybe, let's just see what it looks like lower. And now that's too low. Yeah, wait, no, too high. Wait, right there, wait, wait, yeah, right there. I like it right there. And look at that, I've still never actually had to put up my own command hook. Moment of truth, I love it. Very nice, <laughs> thanks. Before I actually get working on the table, I just wanted to get everything else in the room set. I'm gonna put these little garland pieces up on my picture ledges. Guys, I know, I haven't even actually put pictures in these frames. It's kind of sad, but I need to get around to that. Hopefully I do it before Christmas and before we have like guests over and everything. But I got these from Target. My mom and I were there the other day and there was actually like a picture on the wall of like a little piece of garland hanging off of a 
floating shelf and i was like oh my goodness that would be so cute hanging off of like one of my picture ledges it'll obviously look way better when there's actually pictures in there but i'm gonna do one here and then i think i'll do like one down there these were only 4.99 well i guess that's not like super cheap but i think they're really pretty they're a really pretty green and I think they're a little bit glittery, but not too bad. Does anybody else feel like the entire month of December, they're covered in glitter? Because I think every day I have like glitter in my hair, glitter on my face. Okay, this one's gonna go over here. I can leave this up all winter long. Like it's not necessarily just Christmas. This could be a winter thing. But yeah, it'll look way better once I actually have pictures in the frames. One last thing that I want to do before I get working on my table, cause that's gonna be like my favorite thing, the table. I just wanna get everything else set up. I got these candles. Got these from Bed Bath & Beyond the other day. I love them. I think they're really pretty because they actually have like these little string lights along the outside of them. I just think it kind of makes them look a little different, kind of fun. So I just thought they were really cool. So three came in a pack. And then this is our new little buffet. This is from World Market. I love it. I think it's so cool. We really don't have a ton of storage for like extra dishes or anything like that. I just thought this piece would be really nice to have for just like things that I only use seasonally. So I love this. We can also use it just like as a little buffet too and set things on, but I showed this in a little haul recently. This is from JCPenney. I need to cut the tack off of this, but I really liked it here. I thought it looked really pretty. And then I thought I would put all these candles on it. So we'll see how this ends up looking. Probably gonna look really good at night. Yes. Okay, I gotta get scissors and cut them. So I love the way the room is coming together. Now that I have like everything on the outskirts of the living room or dining room. <laughs> I'm going to get working on the dining room table. Remove this stuff. I actually get a lot of questions about this. So before I remove it, I'm just gonna tell you guys, this table runner is from Target. This and this is both from Kirkland's. I get a lot of questions about it cause I don't think I ever showed it in a haul. I don't think, but really love that for here. But I'm gonna just move it for Christmas. how this tablecloth looks on the table. Now I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the stuff I have to decorate it. Now I showed this in my last like Christmas home decor haul and it was this garland. Got it from Target, I think it was like 30 bucks. I liked it because it had different greenery in it. It has like some eucalyptus and I don't know what those are, but I just thought this would look pretty. The only thing I don't have are little lights and I feel like this really needs like some little tiny string lights running through it because this isn't pre-lit or anything. So that's probably the only thing that I will add after this video is probably like some little tiny, um, are they called like fairy lights or something? I thought I had like a bunch of them here, but I couldn't find any today. So that's probably the only thing I'll add after this video, but I feel like it needs to be ironed or something, you know? If anybody knows how to get, like some of it's like not straight. So 
So if anybody knows a trick to kind of get this flattened out more, please comment below and let me know. Now that I have my garland on, I got these little houses from the Dollar Spot. I also showed these in the haul if you guys missed it. But they had a few different ones like these little small ones and then a little bit larger. These, everybody went crazy for at Target. They're really, really cool. They were five bucks each, but they each have a little light in it. So that's kind of fun. I'm gonna do a little village across the entire table. For some reason, I have seen a lot of these villages like on Pinterest for inspiration for Christmas this year. So I think it's kind of like a trendy thing for um, Christmas decor this year, but I really, really like it. So the Dollar Spot had a lot of these. The Target Wonder Shop had a lot of these. Hopefully I can find some online to share with you guys, but they're really cute. So I got five of those. And then what's gonna make it are these bottle brush trees. I have like, I think I have six, five or six. These were only $5. These were the same price as like the little tiny small ones in the dollar spot section. These were $5 from the Wonder Shop. Really, really cute. And then I also got some taller ones. This one, the taller ones were 10, but I'm just gonna kind of mix everything in together and make it look really cute. But I do think, like I said, little twinkle lights would have been really nice to have through here, but that's something I'm just gonna have to get next time I'm out at the store and then I'll add it in later. You guys will probably see it for my Christmas house too. I think I'm gonna put the trees down because they're larger. So I only have two of these taller trees. So I'm gonna put those, I'm gonna put those in first. I hope they're not like, too tall to where people can't see each other but I'll probably just kind of have to move things around and see how it's going to go. add all of my chargers, plates, and little napkins. And I have these like little napkin rings. These are from TJ Maxx like years ago, but I love them. And all of these, these were, I think these were on our wed wedding registry. These are like linen napkins from Crate and Barrel that I probably have never even used because <laughs> we're not that fancy. But I thought it would look pretty just to have like everything set up at least. These little chargers are here. I hope the gold looks good in here. Maybe it'll kind of like tie in the light, but I know a lot of everything else I've done in here is silver, but these are the only chargers that I have. These are from the Christmas tree shops and I only have six, so I should probably go back and see if I can get a few more because we are going to be hosting Joshua's family's Christmas here, I think. We're gonna have a lot more than six, so we'll actually probably have to set up another table. But in the meantime, this will look pretty. And then these are our plates. They're just like classic white plates. These are from Target and Threshold brand. I'm gonna have those sitting out. And then I think I'm just gonna have my napkins like really simple sitting on the top with a little napkin ring. We're only gonna have two plates until Christmas to use.
guys so this is my completed dining room christmas tour i hope you guys enjoy decorating with me and got a little bit of inspiration for decorating in your home leave a comment down below let me know what you thought like i said earlier i'm going to have links to all the things that i can find down below in the description box so make sure to check that out if you guys are looking for any of these items specifically many more christmasy videos to come so make sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you guys haven't subscribed yet that way you don't miss any of my videos and i will see you guys really soon in my next one bye